Yo, what's going on everybody? It's iPod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. And I would like to welcome you guys to game six of the NBA playoffs round one. I'm going up against the San Antonio Spurs. If you guys know the story, you know that I key gamed it. I ended up being down and now I have to win two more games straight in order to move on to round two. So I have to put all the weight of our team on my shoulders in order to win this game. It's time to see if I can get a triple double and a win. Let's get into this game, y'all. Now, starting off this match, I felt like I had the whip appeal. Now, I know a lot of people are thinking, man, that's a music reference. Why would you say that? Well, in the game of NBA 2K, having the whip appeal means whipping somebody's ass. I'm just saying. Me and Leonard, yeah, we were going at it, you know, all game. But I'm telling you right now, I had the way better highlights. I don't know if he was on autopilot ass or if he was just sitting in coach, but I'm going to tell you right now, he going to get these nuts. I'm just saying, I'm just saying, you know, coach, nuts, what I got to put in the subtitles or something? <laughs> nah, man, but I was having a great game starting off. Now, you know, starting off, having a great game, the double team start happening, passing starts happening, miracles start happening, flashy passes want to start happening, but I can't get fast. She passes to NBA 2K14. I'm sorry, but uh, that rock the cradle right there, yeah, that's a Jordan move. I equipped that package. It was a pretty good move. You know, it was so-so. It was but, you know, it's, it's up to me to win this game. So, from what I've seen, the Spurs aren't looking too good. You know, they start off slow. Then they pick up, you know, in the later quarters, of course. But I feel like I can win every game, you know, and move on to the next round. But you can't count San Antonio out because the way I see it, Game 7 is going to be a hell of a game. Yeah, I'm going to just tell y'all now, I won this game. I don't care. I don't care if it's early in the commentary. I won this goddamn game. But Game 7 is still to be determined because I haven't played it. I don't know the outcome. And playing on Hall of Fame, oh, God. You got to get some type of unrealistic crazy numbers in order to win these games. Now, you guys see the double team coming. It almost looked like a triple team, but I hit my boy on a wing. He nailed that three. These type of things happen all game long. Now, in order for me to get my assists off, I have to do some crazy stuff. I have to run around picks. I got to throw un crazy, just unbearable passes. But did y'all notice that that pass right there got my 10th assist? Yeah. Yeah, I'm just saying, you know, I'm rocking double-doubles and the second quarter ain't even over. You know, it's so easy to get a triple-double in this game. All you got to do is play it smart. If you want to get easy triple-doubles, score 10 points straight. Then get 10 assists, and after you know you run down court on your fast breaks, you, you get out on a break, start, you know, hanging around the rim, start getting your rebounds, and your triple-double will come just like that. Just real easy, but I just wanted to highlight one thing about my signature skills. Now, you guys may have noticed that I have the Gatorade Prime Pack. Now, the only downfall of this Gatorade Prime Pack is that in quarter two, quarter three, and quarter four, the coach subs you out at just random times in the game. I mean, completely random. Check this out. After I get this nice little spin dunk. Yeah, yeah, I turned up for that. <laughs> I turned up and got me a nice little spin dunk. It wasn't no contact there. I thought that Tim Duncan might have hit my hand. But after I get the spin dunk, maybe a few plays later, they sub me out again. And they actually sub me out for almost the whole second quarter. So, yes, the Gatorade Prime Pack does enable you to play the entire first quarter. But for the rest of the quarters of the game, you're going to be going to the bench at sporadic, just random times. But did anybody catch that uh, that little pump right there? Check that out. You know what I'm saying? I heard the holes like that. I'm just saying, you know, with the curly top going inside, dunking like that, you know, my curls don't move. I heard they was liking it. But check this play out right here. Starting off in the third quarter, this is where they turn up. This is where Ginobili the Jack turns up. And it's so funny because I've never seen Ginobili catch an alley-oop in 2K. And, of course, I think it's unrealistic. But, hey, it is what it is. Even I got dunked on in the last clip. But, hey, man, you know when guys get the cookies, I start getting crazy out here. So, you know, I thought off the board to myself. I decided, you know what, I want to have a little fun. So, why not throw it off the backboard to myself? Now, I know a lot of people are thinking, why didn't you show a replay of that? Guess what? It happens a little bit later in this game. you just going to have to wait for it. But, 
LeBron James was not in this game, so that dunk was not able to be blocked. But it's all good because we going to get the cookies. I'm just saying, you know, I'm out on the break. You know, I see somebody in front of me hitting with a nice little spin, fake. And check out my boy, Austin. Who would have known he had bunnies like that? Who would have known he had the control like that? And look at Kawhi Leonard. Look at that. Tasting them nuts. I told you you're going to get these nuts. I'm just saying, you and coach, brother. Ain't no first class over here. You don't get that Swiss cheese sandwich. You get these nuts. I'm just saying. <laughs> but I'm still putting on the moves with the jump shot. Man, I'm going to tell you guys now. You want the jump shot that I have. Go inside the about section. Look at the jump shot. Equip it on your player. Go into a shoot around and shoot with this player. I promise you. My hand up to God. This is probably the best jump shot on 2K. It doesn't matter if it's late, if it's early, if the timing is off, if the range is a little bad. I'm telling y'all now, that jump shot is crazy. But I also wanted to show you guys a few clips of the Spurs because I always know how people say, hey man, this is a one-man show. Show a little bit of what's going on with the team. Well, the Spurs tried to battle back, right? But uh, what had happened was, it's this little roadblock called the Sad Sheet Stuffer. And yeah, he turns up. So check me out with a nice little spin out of the post. I'm telling y'all, that jumper crazy. I know you see the C+. Yeah, I ain't playing on rookie. This ain't no pro nonsense going on. It's just that jump shot is just that beautiful. Also, remember that clip I was telling y'all about of me throwing it off the backboard? Yeah, that kind of just happened again on a fast break. So I got to show y'all a nice little replay, you know what I'm saying? Hey, 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 it is what it is. But the game is almost over. You know, it's three minutes left in the fourth quarter. But I just wanted to show you guys these nice little momentum jumpers. Oh, my goodness. If you guys want to make your videos pop, you have to start adding jump shots to your videos. I'm telling you right now. Because jump shots, they just seem and feel and look so beautiful. Check out that little jump shot right there. That's that Kevin Durant feel. You guys know when Kevin Durant comes off a screen and you like, I got you, KD. And then hit you with a nice little hop step jumper and you be pissed. That's what I'm talking about. But, oh, yeah, the proof is in the pudding. I'm going to need y'all to run that, that little thing back. You see that little range meter right there? I was nowhere near anywhere in the vicinity but i was able to hit the jump shot i'm just saying you know the proof is in the pudding y'all might want to go in the about section check out that jump shot and get with it but uh this is ikc signing out i'm gonna holla at y'all in the next playoff game and i'm gonna leave it up to my boy casey and jalil beats for the rest of this video and then we're gonna hop into the press conference peace y'all this ain't the game i'm terrorizing everything i'm too mean you can put faith in them lanes when they play me, man, they all gon' look the same uh, And it's a shame, like a room We bang that all the light to get the night pop. Yeah. Tweeting all my fans and let them know How much I'm dropping, losing ain't an option Rookie of the year is who you're watching Play through the whistle, boy, it ain't no stopping Pick and roll, give and go Pull up, it's a swish you know Kiss it off the glass, where's the mistletoe In your faces where all of these long range missiles go I cross you over, then I dish it off It's getting real when they forgetting that I'm fiction No, I'm getting physical, but I work out And let the coach know what my work about I gotta be one of the best more forwards that you know about I'm lacing up my sneaks and I'ma show out Double team dream, make breaks out of the king the mamba looks like a garden stick to me. Well, it all comes down to game seven, and you guys will be playing at home. You got to feel like you're in the driver's seat at this point, right? We're in a good position, and I'm so glad that we'll be playing that game in front of our fans. That alone is like having another player out there on the court with us. But don't sleep on the other guys. They want it just as much as we do. So it's going to come down to who wants it more. Who can dig down deepest and leave it all out there on the court? And I think that that's this team. But the games are played on the court, not behind a podium. So let's get out there and see what happens, baby. Yerp, this is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.